Well, hello again, my vloggies. Today is Sunday, which makes tomorrow Monday, and Monday is my weigh-in day. And I'm not looking forward to it, and I'm sure you know why. Um, one is because of the pizza, and two, I just... I haven't had a good week food-wise. I'm not sure why. I've been tracking and I've been keeping up with, like, my weekly points and my activity points. And it seems like, for some reason, I just keep shoving food in my mouth that I don't need. And like I said, I'm not really sure why. Um, so I'm trying to, I guess, to kind of get back to the things that I was doing when I first started. I started to think back on it. And there were two things that I did when I first started. And when I first started, I was averaging uh, losing a pound or two a week. I, I'm afraid when I weigh in tomorrow, basically, that I'm either going to have maintained or that I'm going to have gone up a little bit. I'm I'm really afraid I'm going to have gone up a little bit, which, uh, I mean, if it's just a pound or so, I don't, I mean, I don't want to go up a pound, of course, but I can't feel super bad about it. I mean, whose fault is it if I go up a pound? It's mine. You all didn't force me to eat food. No one was shoving food down my throat into my tummy to turn it into fat. So, it was just me. And, yeah, like I said, I'm not working for it to it. But anyway, the two things that I'm trying to do, that I've decided hopefully will help me out. One, when I very first started doing Weight Watchers, I was drinking a lot of water. Which I don't do as much anymore. I might get water when I get on the treadmill. But um, I've also been drinking a lot of Powerade and stuff on the treadmill. Which is probably not the same. Like they're Powerade zeros. They're still zero points. But it's it's not water. And water is, water is what we're supposed to drink. That's why it's here on the earth. Instead of rivers of soda and chocolate milk. Not at the same time. Not rivers of soda and chocolate milk together. But like two separate rivers of soda. And one of chocolate milk. I don't know. I'm just saying, water is what we're supposed to drink. It's the best thing for you to drink. So today already, I've drank like two huge glasses of water. And honestly, I am a little less hungry than I usually am. I'm more hydrated. Full of tasty, calorie-free waters. The second thing I'm doing that I've decided I'm going to do... I'm going to try it for a week and see how it goes, but... I am not going to track my activity points. Now I know I just made a video of you for you all telling you how awesome activity points are and they are totally awesome. But I think all I do is like all I do is abuse them like unless there's something coming up that I know that I need them, I just do stuff and then eat them. And I use them as an excuse to eat things that I shouldn't eat. Cuz it's not like I use my activity points to like eat some other healthy food. I use my activity points to have like some cookies or some leftover Easter candy or something like that that I shouldn't be putting in my mouth anyway. <sighs> I abuse them and I'm sorry activity points that I abuse you. I will try not to do it anymore. So like I said I'm gonna go a week. I'm well let me let me rephrase that. I'm not going to count anything that is not what I would actually call exercise. So if I get on the treadmill, I'll still count my, my 30 minutes on the treadmill or whatever. But I'm not going to count, like, my cleaning and stuff. Even though it is... I'm supposed to be able to count them as points. But like I said, I just... I get those points and I just, I just do bad things with them. So I'm not going to count those for a week and see if that helps me get a little back on track. Because I'm so close. I'm, like, this close to my 20 pounds. The last time I weighed in, it was 0 .6. 0 .6 pounds is what I needed to lose to get down to my 20, which my 20 pound weight loss, I'd be at um at 270. 270 would be my 20 pound loss. So, I doubt I'm going to make it when I weigh in tomorrow, unless some sort of miracle happens. Unless an adipose baby walks off me. That would be awesome. She needs to send out her little signal, Miss Foster. That was her name. Send out her little signal. Push the little button and just let my fat walk away and take it to another planet. You know that's cool. Just go far away to another planet. 
instead of sitting here on my tummy. Yeah. Yeah. Otherwise, I'm bored again today. I'm bored whenever Chris isn't here because I'm, I don't know if you know this, but I don't have a job right now. I just, I know I told you I just recently moved out of my parents' house and I moved in with my fiance, Chris, the dude. You saw him. You know he's a dude. And it's been, been very hard finding a job here. So I clean and do housewifey things and wait for him to get home. And tonight we're going to watch a wrestling pay-per-view and I'm very excited about it. Wrestling makes me laugh. They're so funny. They're so funny. But anyway, I just wanted to tell you about my way in for tomorrow. So I'll probably vlog at you again being all sad and depressed, probably. I'm 80% I'm sure I'm going to be sad and depressed. But. I want to show you something silly that I know no one cares about but me. But I think it's totally awesome. I got it at the craft fair yesterday. We told you we were going to the craft fair and do all this stuff. And we, we sold pretty well considering how many people were there because it wasn't a lot. But I got me some sheep yarn. From like people that actually own their own sheeps and make their own yarn and stuff. So this is my nice natural sheepy yarn. I was telling Chris on the phone earlier that this yarn looks like, like it's like gray. It's like a gradienty gray color. I don't know if you can see it. But it's the same color if you like, if you shaved my cat and turned it into yarn, it would probably look like this. And this is going to sound really weird, but it smells really good. I guess it smells like a clean sheep. I don't know. I imagine this is what a really clean sheep would smell like. And it's really soft. And they even rolled it into a ball for me, which was really nice of them. Because I don't think they really have to roll it into a ball for you. But it saved me from having to do it. I like to talk to people about yarn and crafty things. And they were really nice. So it's my sheep yarn. I'm going to go make something special with it just for me. Maybe I'll show you later in like an outtake if you care about my sheep yarn. But Anyway, I guess I'll vlog at you all tomorrow. I hope you are having a better weight loss week than I am. It will all be better. It's feedback, not failure. It's feedback. So if I gain a bunch of weight tomorrow, I'll know not to do it again next week. Totally true. Bye.